Hi there. Now for part B of this question, we've got to show that the Cartesian equation for this curve C here is given by this x plus y all squared plus ay squared equals b, where a and b are integers to be determined. Now to do this, in the first part we found out that x plus y equal 2 root 3 cosine t. And all I'm going to do now is square both sides of this so that I can get on the right hand side here cos squared t and then I'm going to use a trig identity that cos squared t is 1 minus sine squared t and link it into this equation here for y and hopefully should be able to reduce it down to this form. So let's start then by saying that x plus y equals 2 root 3 cosine of t and then if we square both sides we then end up with x plus y all squared equals 2 root 3 when you square that that's 4 times 3 so that's 12 and then you've got cos squared t. So now all we need to do is just pick up on the fact that cos squared t is 1 minus sine squared t and substitute this in, that y equals 2 sine t. So therefore what we've got then is x plus y all squared equals 12 times 1 minus sine squared t. And if I expand the bracket here, okay we'll leave the left hand side the same, x plus y all squared equals, then we've got 12 here, and then we've got minus 12 times sine squared t. But we know that sine t is y over 2. So this is going to be y over 2 all squared. And so therefore if I expand the right hand side we've got 12 minus and then this is going to be y squared over 4. So you're going to get 12y squared over 4 which reduces down to 3y squared. So we've got minus 3y squared. So I can just add 3y squared to both sides and therefore we've got x plus y all squared plus 3y squared is equal to 12. So I can see then that this is identical to x plus y squared plus ay squared equaling b where a and b are constants and I can finish off by saying where a is clearly 3 and b equals the 12. Okay